you, everybody. Richard DeVos, co-founder of Amway and a very rich man, wants more Americans to be able to get what he's got, a transplanted organ. I was 71 when I received a new heart. And you can look at me. I've been five years, over five years, since I got a new heart. DeVos went to London for his transplant because there is a critical shortage of donated hearts and other organs here in the U.S. Right now, 80,000 Americans are waiting for a transplant, and it's likely that this year 7,000 of them will die waiting. DeVos would like to change that and has proposed a radical solution, a payment of $10,000 to anyone who legally commits to being an organ donor while they are alive. The payment would go to the donor's estate when they die. It's like a toaster at the bank, you know. Say, hey, if you will sign up, we will put $10,000 in your estate for you to do with what you want. All of the efforts that have been undertaken so far to try to increase the incentive for people to become organ donors have failed. Pennsylvania Congressman James Greenwood believes the estate payment idea could save lives. But federal law bans the sale of human organs, and the National Kidney Foundation worries that such a ghoulish plan could turn off potential donors. It's quite possible that the number that we turn away could equal or exceed the number of additional families we bring to the table. Richard DeVos says ethical objections do not change the simple facts. Unless we find a way to increase the pool of available donor organs in this country, thousands of Americans who could be saved will not see another year. Steve Brown, Fox News.